Hello? That was cool. So growing up, I watched a lot of movies and TV, and something that I noticed early on was that a lot of these movies took place in a high school setting, and something else that I realized early on was that a lot of these high school settings were just cluttered with high school stereotypes. And as a high school student myself, I found that these stereotypes are actually complete garbage. So without further ado, I present to you <clears throat> inaccurate high school stereotypes that are presented through media such as movies and TV. <laughs> Oh my god, Jennifer, do you see her hair? It looks like a literal bird's nest. Oh my god, did you hear what she said to me? She said, thank you? What is that supposed to mean? Honestly, what a batch. Stupid batch. So like, I was with Brad the other day, and he said that like, I'm the second prettiest girl on the cheer team. So like now, I think I'm just gonna tell like everybody in the school that he has herpes. I'm on the football team. Football. Football. What'd you say? What time is it? Oh, oh, swole o'clock. Wait, what'd you say? We're study hall? Oh, I think it's that way. Oh, oh. I don't know why she's freaking out, dude. All I said was that she's the second prettiest girl on the cheer team. That's like a compliment. I'm just a kid and a life is a nightmare. AV club. AV club. <laughs> Well, well, actually, that's not entirely accurate. The circumference of the... <laughs> Chess club. Mrs. Jones, Jonathan's trying to copy off of my test. I just wanted to let you know because some people like me actually have academic integrity. Asthma. Asthma. <laughs> Give me your, give me your lunch money, Jimmy. Look at you. You look, you look like a stupid butt face. Give me your lunch money, butt face. Nerd. Nerd. <laughs> what are those books? <laughs> Whoops. You dropped your books, nerd. <laughs> Give me your lunch money or I'll shove you in the locker, butt face. Personally, I don't know what planet these stereotypes were based off of. I don't know if these characters are from some fourth dimension that I'm not aware of. And maybe these people are actually realistic. Maybe it's just me that hasn't seen a bully walk up to some kid and say, Give me your lunch money. But yeah, that's all I have for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy it. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. If you don't leave a like and subscribe, I'm going to push you up against the locker and make you eat your own sock. Oh.